Welcome back to another episode of Cookies Row. I'm glad to have you back. As you can see, I'm working on a little bridge here. I used some dirt to make it. But don't worry, the dirt's only temporary. I'm just trying to get a feel for the shape of it. I want to see if it's going to look good before I commit to it. And you're probably wondering why I need a bridge. So let's show you. Ah, new addition to Cookies Realm. As you can see, she's beautiful behind there. The sun coming right across her from the back. But like I said, before I commit, I want to make sure she is looking good, this bridge. And I think I'm going to go with it. Uh, this tree may have to go. So I'm going to come right back to you after it's done with just some stones. And let's take a look after that. As you can see, I used some cobblestones. She tend to take shape. She's looking good. I like the way she's show shaping up. Uh, I think we're just going to do a little finishing touches here. I'm going to put some cobblestone slabs in the middle. I use stone slabs on the edge. Oh no. Oh, why did I do that? Oh, where's my pickaxe? Oh, much better. As I was saying, um, I put stone slabs on the outer rim and cobblestone slabs, oh not cobblestone, but brick stone in the middle to make it look a little different, a little bit better. Uh, just try to give it a little face, a little nice little look to it. I'm hoping that uh, you'll like it, but it's starting to take shape. It's starting to look real good. So let me finish this off. Almost there, almost there. A few more. Yep, almost looking good. If I do say so myself, she's starting to take shape. She's starting to look good, and I do like the difference between the stone on the edge and the stone bricks in the middle. Yep, she's looking really good. I, I'm starting to really like how this is turning out. Well, I think we only need a couple more things to do on this bridge. I'm going to have to come over here to the welcome mat and get it. I'm looking for some oak posts. There they are. Oak fence. And I'm um, going to use that for the trimming on the outside. I don't want nobody falling off. So let's see how this looks. Once I place them. Here, here. Straight across here. Yeah. I mean the bridge is taking shape, it's looking nice. Hopefully this will add to it. You know, let me know what you think. You know, leave comments, let me know what you think. You know if something here doesn't agree with you, let me know and maybe I'll change it, you know. I want you guys to like what I'm building here as well. So don't be afraid, leave comments. You know, leave likes. If you like the video, please, by all means, leave a like. But more importantly, you know, comments, comments, and comments. That way I know what, if I'm, what I'm doing is right and what I'm doing is wrong. If you like, if you don't like, if I need to change something, you know, let me know. But I think overall, I think this is starting to look good. This, this bridge is starting to look amazing. Yep, um... Yeah, it's starting to really look real good. I like it. I like it a lot. Just a few more items left to add on to this bridge. Especially now that it's going to start getting dark soon. Let me go to this chest and let me drop off some of this stuff. I got so much stuff on me that I don't need right now. Get rid of that. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. Let me get these. These we need. I'm going to add these certain spots. Like I said, the sun's going down, so one there, one there. And maybe one in the middle somewhere, a little further, a little right about here, I think. Yeah, it looks good. Let's put one evenly on the other side, I hope. I've been known not to put them evenly from time to time. Same on this side, one on this stone 
and one on this one. Take a look. Oh man, it's looking fantastic. I mean, totally fantastic. So I think with that said, I think it's time for uplink mode. Let's take a look. Welcome back from that blink mode. If you like that blink mode, hit that like button. Now let's cross over this bridge and take a better look at the building. As you can see, we use some of the new building blocks from the nether. I think that bluish color makes it look really nice here. I also added this cobblestone steps up here and the pathway to the bridge. On this side, we have Margaret's home. And on the other side, We have La Margarita Restaurante, which is Spanish for restaurant. Close this door. Here we have a bar where the customers can gather, have a couple of drinks while they're waiting for the tables. Over here we have in the reception area. We have tables here on both sides. A kitchen through here. As you can see, something's cooking right here. We got a... Uh, chicken on this one here we got salmon on there as you can see I put some shelving ventilation a shelf here overall she looks real nice let's go upstairs and take a look as you can see we have more eating areas with some uh, separations with these um, the bushes Making it look real nice without adding a wall, but making a wall it makes it really look nice. Here on this corner, we have another dining area. Maybe it's... overall, I think it looks great here. I'm not quite sure what we're gonna put. If you walk this way, you will see that we have a small little balcony to look out. Looks real nice. Let's head downstairs. Take a look. Behind the reception area, we have this door here, which leads downstairs to a wine cellar and storage. As you can see, we have storage on one side, the wine barrels on another side, some more storage and pumpkins. I think it came out real nice on the ground and hidden. And if we go through this door right here, we have a patio on the back. We got a couple of tables with umbrellas, a nice chimney to cook, an outdoor oven. Overall, I think she looks good. She looks amazing. Uh, 
I'm really glad for this one. The video for the inspiration of this one, the link will be down below. Please take a look at that. Here in Margarita's home, as you can see, we haven't done much yet. She's not ready yet. We still have to get stairs to the second floor and build. So she's still a work in progress. So I will update you when this is done. Overall, I mean, she looks fantastic even on the outside. We have flowers. I think that blue from the nether um, just pops. It makes the building look nice. We got to do something about this. We're going to have to change that little... Again, a little um, excavating, get rid of that mound of dirt. Walk through here. But overall, I have to say, she is beautiful, she is great, and I hope you like it. Now, let me give you a little update on storage area. Uh, maybe close this, maybe not a great idea, leave them open. As you can see here, we have um, my wood on this side, all the different variants. Saplings up there, miscellaneous down there, empty chest. Fix the walls. Over here we have my stone variants. Redstone in this one. Little riches I have on this one. You know, I also fixed the floor with stone and stone bricks. I mean, it looks great. I also did this little spot right here because I plan to do something here. I'm not quite sure yet. Maybe an armory, maybe a villager trading hall, uh, some kind of farm. I'm not quite sure yet what I'm going to do. But you know what? Leave comments. Let me know what you want to see me build here. You know, whatever. Like I said, an armory, village or trading hall, something, some kind of farm, whatever you think is best. You know, leave some comments and let me know and I'll see what I can do. But overall, it's starting to take shape and I like it. Let's go out this way. Hit the wrong button. I may change those doors. I'm not quite sure yet. Leave comments. Let me know what you think of those doors. Maybe I'll change them too. Anyway, let's take this back to where we, it all started. I want to uh, say a couple of things. First of all, uh, Coquitesville is growing. As you can see from the videos, I want to thank the Romans who are participating. I want to thank those who allow themselves to be recorded. Koki, Makui, and a few that will appear later on. Um, for those who do not wish to be recorded, that is fine. I have to respect that, and it's great. Um, if you want to be recorded, that's great. If you don't want to be recorded, that's also great. No harm done, no foul. Everybody's entitled to their choice. Yeah, this is as free as free as can be. For those who are helping out around, I want to thank you very much. Let me talk this here. Now, I think in the next episode, we're going to finally work, do something here, that fishing hut, fishing house. It's about time it gets done. I think also in the next episode or in between episodes, these pathways may have to be finished because they are currently not attached to anything. Some are, some not, but maybe I'll attach them now to the bakery, the butcher shop. My quiz is that way as well. Also to the tower over here, the new restaurant, cookies, mushroom. I mean, little by little, you know, we'll get it done. With that being said, I, I want to thank you all once again for watching. I hope that uh, all of you are safe. It's a crazy world. Wear your mask, be safe, take care of yourselves. With that being said, this is Willow signing off and with that I'm going to leave you with a little clip